Well, the very first Central Texas Working Dog competition is in Fort Hood this week. I love this. That's right. It's a competition between different working military dogs and canine units across Texas. Our six news reporter Sydney Deshawn went to the event today. Sydney, how was it? Chris Lindsay, these dogs seriously are not messing around. Canine units from a total of nine different agencies and 18 canine teams are competing this week. Outside units from the Williamson County Sheriff's Office, Coriel County Sheriff's Office, Temple PD, Dallas PD, University of Texas PD, Austin Transportation Security Administration, and the Texas Department of Pub Public Safety are all competing. The dogs competed for aggression and the hardest hit earlier this morning. Judges rank the dogs based on their speed, the way they hold the bite, and how much air they get. And while training the dogs are important, it's also about building stronger relationships between the different agencies. Today's one of those days where we get to work with our brothers and sisters from all over Central Texas. We get to build these foundations that have been long overdue. It's not just on Fort Hood, it's outside agencies working together, coming together and building this training and seeing where we can all come together and build the capabilities of these dog teams. Water aggression and confidence scouting, tracking and trailing are more points of focus for the dog competition this week. Now at six, we will hear from some of the dog handlers and people who were actually inside of the fence. Yeah, aggression and hardest the hits today. It feels like an NFL <laughs> combine. I love it. Yeah. yeah, don't commit a crime, folks. <laughs> yeah. one of those There's stuff. a little sampling of what will happen. Yeah, they might bite you for real. Yeah. All right, Sydney, thanks so much. We're looking forward Good to point. six o'clock. Good point. <laughs>